The State Department vowed to do something about a father held hostage for years and a family's desperate plea for action. Here's ABC's chief global affairs correspondent Martha Raddatz with the story. These are the latest images of Robert Levinson, the last proof of life sent anonymously via email to Levinson's family more than a year ago, kept secret in hopes it would help his chances. Until now. They're very difficult to look at. Even today, some of our daughters were um, crying to me over the phone about how upset they were to see them again. It was nearly six years ago when the father of seven disappeared from the Iranian island of Kish, where he was working as a private investigator. His family has no doubts. They believe Iran is responsible. We'd appreciate higher level um, talks, higher level discussions um, uh, um, from our government. But relations with Iran are extremely tense. America locked in a simmering standoff. Anger and fear over Iran's nuclear program. And now, Iran being suspected in the recent massive cyber attack on U.S. banks disrupting service to millions of Americans. These cyber attacks have become much more sophisticated in nature than they were in the past. In fact, Hillary Clinton says there is nothing that has worried her more as Secretary of State than Iran, not only the prospect of a nuclear weapon, but its part in terrorism all over the world, which of course complicates ongoing efforts to find and free Robert Levinson.